com using vc++ com control example using vc++ and atl run the visual studio as administrator select new from file menu and select project select visual c++ select atl project type your project name and browse location click ok and create the project atl is the active template library which is a set of template based c++ classes that simplify writing small and fast com objects the atl project wizard creates a project with the structures to contain com objects in the support options select support mfc Go to the Solution Explorer, right click on the project name and add a new class. Add an ATL control class. Give a name for the class and select connection points as the support. Set smart device options as shown. Now add a method as shown. Copy the code for detecting the operating system. Type or paste the code here. Execute the project. Now, go to the project menu and go to the properties of the project. In the C or C++ settings change SDL checks. SDL checks include extra security relevant warnings as errors and additional secure code generation features. Now, again execute the project. A .dll file or a control library cannot be started directly. Add a new project for testing the object. Add a Visual C Sharp Windows Forms application. Give a meaningful name for the form.
execute the project. Now at the reference of the created control object or DLL file, go to the solution explorer, right click on the references and add a reference. Now search our library file here and select it as shown. Created control object is added into the toolbox. Now go to the toolbox and search our control object. Drag and drop the component into the form. Again execute the project. Now go to the configuration manager and update the settings as shown. Now execute the project. Now Add a button and add a message box in the button click as shown. Again execute the project and verify the output.